All right, guys, I'm doing the intro after we're done sandblasting for today just because this is when I got time to do it. I've been running around trying to get work done all day, so sorry for the intro after the fact, but you guys will see start to finish on sandblasting nevertheless. So hope you guys enjoy. We're going to be sandblasting with a pot, and we bought sand by uh, one-ton bags, which has been featured in previous videos, so definitely keep up on that, and hope you guys enjoy. Alright guys, so they're pretty much done sandblasted. We took a break, but as you can see there's still a little green paint around there. Some places we couldn't get. We ended up detaching the blade from the body itself, or the mounting, and so we will get to the rest of that. So as you can see, where we did were able to get, it took the paint right off and all the rest. So it's looking pretty good. We cleaned out some of the dirt we weren't able to get in before. We took the blade off, and them John Deere stickers will also leave, and we'll get new ones for that. Because if you guys haven't followed us on previous videos, you will know that the we're going to be painting all this and redoing it, restoring it. So that's blade number one, guys. So it's all getting ready to be painted. And I thought I'd explain some of this stuff. Uh, this is called the pot, or sandblasting pot. So that's an air compressor, and the air compressor pushes air down through the hose... All the way to the sandblasting pot, which then lets the sand go out, pushed by air, through this, all the way to the end with nozzle, which you saw us running. Um, this end nozzle, it's special for sandblasting, and it's called a dead man. Now, what a dead man is, and no, not the reality dead man, but what this is, is it is safety mechanism, so that when you, so like there, you're sandblasting, when you kick it off like that, it quits sandblasting, and it shuts the air off. Some sandblasters, unless, or well, any sandblaster, unless you have that tool, which is called a dead man, will just sandblast continuously, and there's not really a way to shut it off, unless you shut off the air compressor. So, when you hit that off, then it quits blowing sand, and the air compressor goes back to an idle and quits making air. So, anyway, just thought I would tell you that. Also, here comes Justice, running like a hero. Uh, we're doing sand that we used almost a whole bag of sand. We're probably going to continue and use the whole bag of sand on these blades, guys. This is one Justice started working on. Like I said, we haven't got done yet, so we're still working on it. But he's working on this, and you can see the difference just between where he's done and where he hasn't. I mean, over there it's gray, and over there it's green. So, and he's got the mounting brackets done, which that would have been a hard job. I know that, because he used all them sides, guys. That's the problem, all the angles. So, with that said, guys... That's what we're going to be doing. We'll finish this, and then we are going to get on to painting them. All right, guys, so we are done sandblasting for today. We're going to finish it up tomorrow and then start painting and clue you guys in on what we're doing there. Um, just thought I would tell you guys thank you for viewing our channel. I very much appreciate it. Don't forget to subscribe down below. Follow us on Instagram and hit the like button if you would. Uh, if you have any comments or questions or even suggestions, if you've done this before and you think we're doing it wrong or you think there would be an easier way to do it, don't forget to comment that down below because we definitely appreciate the help, guys. I hope you guys have an awesome, blessed day.